My name is Dick Peterson. I play banjo and tenor guitar. I'm Roy Perhofsky. I play piano, trombone, uh, and guitar. The interesting thing is we, we both know the same set of musicians because he was the leader of Barbara Ghost Jazz Band, which is very renowned and very successful. And I was part of the Moby Fig Jazz Band. And it, what made it sweet is the same musicians that played with Barbara Ghost played with Moby Figs. So remarkably enough, we had never met until that day at five so at the reception. Met at Roy's house. He and I just jamming a little bit and it expanded to bringing in other musicians not affiliated. I really wondered whether I could bring a lot of that. And as soon as we got the guys together and called the tunes, things I hadn't played for decades and couldn't have named them, somebody mentioned them, uh, they were back. Uh, and it's still uh, kind of amazing. Go ahead and I got talking about it, thought it would be fun to have a, a flagstone Dixieland band. Well, one thing about Dixieland music, if you know your instrument and you played some Dixieland music, even if you haven't played with some other players, there are certain rules you kind of follow and uh, you, it sounds just like you've you been playing for a long time. Now to be able to play again with these great musicians this is a real thrill for, I think, for Roy and myself. Men, tremendous. It's just life-changing. It just still amazes me, and I have to wake up and you know, realize it every morning, is that uh, both of our bands had been disbanded several years ago, and neither of us had any expectation of playing in a band. Mm -hmm. and, and all of a sudden, it's just happened. So I'm still get pretty excited talking about it. Yeah, we just don't want to give up playing, even if we have some health situations uh, that may detour that, but uh, I'd like to play for a long time. With all the years you put into this, uh, to, to be a proficient at the instrument, it just doesn't make sense to give it up just because you're a little older. I'm the same way. I, I don't want to give up the instrument, and I'll keep playing even Nobody else wants to hear me play because it's me so good. Staff is unbelievable. Yeah. The staff is yeah. absolutely unbelievable. With these maintenance guys, uh, I've never met such friendly people and that solve problems and are so responsive. Where we can go to just make people have a just smile and feel good about the music. And that's that's what our mission is. That's that's the way I feel about it too. I, I playing music a, a great joy, and it's multiplied when I can make some other people enjoy. That that's can't get any better. Than that. Just to encourage the people to be musicians, uh, the, uh, there's a lot of regret of having played and realizing that you let something go that was more valuable than you thought. And so I want to encourage people who are into music to realize that it only gets better as they get 